Hi everyone. If I've got a, a long line of string or even variables in a Cout statement, for example, I'm going to copy this once and twice to generate a very long string. So, yeah. So this, when I run the program, really nothing's going to change. It's just going to print it all in one Cout. But for me as a programmer, I don't want to be scrolling horizontally like this. So I could break this down into lines. So if I do this like this, um, you'll notice that if I execute or compile this program, I've got errors there. So I need to actually um, terminate each string uh, at the end of each line using a double quotation and start off with double quotations as well. So ending with double quotations. So um, each string starts with double quotation and ends with one on each line. Now if I compile it, this should be okay. Now if I have a variable that I also want to display, then I would also use the insertion operator. That's another way as well. So this way, this gives me an option to add different kind of data other than string within my program. So if I have a variable um, named, for example, um, a number, uh, then I could also include it within my Cout. But I haven't got this defined, so I, I would take it off. Otherwise, I'll have to define it. And now when I compile this and execute, nothing's going to change, uh, but this is easier for me to manage when I've got this long string on three separate lines instead of one. So that's the way to do it. Thank you. I'll see you in the next one.